What's popping? How you guys doing? See my hair is so rough. I'm so excited. So this is exactly one week, one week and a day since I went for that interview, and that was on a what's today? Today is Thursday. Today is Wednesday. That interview was on a Tuesday, and she said that if I do not hear from her before Friday, it is what it is. One thing about all these crochets, I've been a cro. See you guys. I know that the correct pronunciation is crochet or something of such, but when I'm like cro crochet, I don't even know how to pronounce it. They're like eh, eh, crochet, crochet. I'm like okay, okay, it's fine. Crochet. Or whatever you call it just find that like it's more final when your hair is old apart from this part obviously i even preferred all these things scattered than when they were just neat scattered and finer than it here take it from me let me look for a better way to style this thing before i continue my just so she said if i don't get um a feedback before before friday meaning that i'm not getting the job so i was like hmm, okay i don't know why i was so confident about this particular one but yeah I scattered the hair again. My friend Deborah kept on asking me and asking me. <laughs> I was like, I even gave up, safe. No, I did not give up until I had a dream. Because she said on a particular date, there will be a workers training on this day that they are bringing somebody from somewhere. I was like, oh, okay. So in the dream, I saw all the workers seated, obviously, they're having this training. And I was just somewhere excluded with the owner of the place. So I'm thinking, ah. Maybe they were having this meeting and I walked in to come and buy something. I told everyone about the dream, my best friend, and I just took it off my head. Fast forward to today, I'm here and I got a call. Let me just tell you, I don't answer numbers. Especially since I came to this Lagos. I don't answer numbers. I don't know why. Before I answer the number, I would just look, I'll be looking at it and I'm wondering who is this one that is calling me? Who, who, who are you? Who are you? After it rang once, twice, three times, four times, I just said, let me pick. And I'm like, hello, am I on to Miss Ife? And I'm like, hmm? People that know me as Ife are like people that, I don't know, except from now that I turned the name to like, Ayaba Ife, Ayaba Ife everywhere. So most people know me as Roda. It's always Roda, Roda, Roda. I'm not Ife. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm calling you from so so, so place. Did you get an uh, email? I'm like, no, I could not get it. I say, okay, check your meal. And I checked and they sent it yesterday morning. I mean, yesterday afternoon. And that period, my phone was off. So that's why I did not get that notification. Otherwise, I'm always checking my email for all these jobs, tons of jobs that I'm applying for. Anyways, I got the job. I can got the job. You know, I can do so well. Like, if it's my personal video, I can edit it to my satisfaction. But now that I'm working with somebody again, I just hope that. I I meet her expectations, so that's it. And I saw the email, and I replied. And this is the kind of content creation work I love. I've done content creation in lounge. So I was like, why are you working in the night? To be honest, apart from beauty content, I love food content, like food, drinks, and all those things. I love it. But I just left it because mm, that one was night own. I just stopped at the point. Is it this Lagos? I don't know if it's Lagos or where I'm staying. Nine o'clock, the whole place is as quiet as a graveyard. And I'm thinking that ah, what's going on here? And I just I worked for like one month. And then I've been working in some other places where I just have to create like one time content and they pay me two time content, two weeks, things like that. And I actually love that kind of job because you can shuffle between here and here work in the morning work in here there was a time i'm working morning in a different place at night in a different place so i like jobs like that because you can shuffle it but for me to be happy about this one don't play with it don't play with it don't play with it baby so guys i'm about to treat my skin forget this thing that you were seeing here i promise you eh is the camera forget this thing you're seeing here my skin is fucking bad ah this front camera can blow up things too Oh, no, no, no. So I paid for consultation. She booked me for 9 a.m. this morning, right? And when she said, okay, I'm booking you for 9 a.m. today, like this morning, in my head, I'm like, that means it's video call. And I'm not about that video call thing. It is so awkward. I kid you not. I don't know how to do all these video calls and all these things. Like, never, except. Even, I swear to God, even with my siblings, like, it is so awkward. I'll just keep on cracking stupid joke to avoid being shy or all those kind of things. So when she was like, 
am I convenient to do video call immediately? I knew so that's why like yesterday when the sun was still out, I went outside and I did a proper video of my face because I knew it was going to be video call. So I sent her the video and she recommended some products for me. So when I saw that list, at the end of the day, I'm like, let me invest in my skin. I can't even complain. And I even asked for this video is coming long, but I even asked for like to stockpile. And she was like, it's only possible <coughs> for a week. I'm like, eh? So you mean in a week I should produce all this kind of money? For government speaking, where I be? Hey. All right, okay. She said we're repairing my skin first and I might get darker during the process. And I hear that darker, I'm like, hey. If I look darker than this, am I about to be a rear? The <laughs> job that was going to spoil my December plans, I ran away from it. And now I've entered another one. Mm. This morning, eh? This money making life, eh? It's not easy. Mm. I think I've said this before. It sounded like deja vu. 48 hours later. Hi, my loves. I was about to send this particular mini gist. I wanted to send it on Snap with people I keep strict with, but I'm like, let me just take it to my YouTube channel. Make the vlog sweet small because I don't know again. I was just complaining how I don't have any doctor friends. Like, you know, when you just see things on your body or you just notice. You just notice something with any part of your body and you want to quickly call your doctor friend from the comfort of your home to just like before even trying to go to a pharmacy or even hospital so that was i just wanted to complain about then i now remember what happened to me in ss2 i mean i don't know how the gist shall linked up but i remember one time when i was in ss2 i touched my breast and you guys I touched my breast and I felt like there was lump in it. <laughs> so that's how I told my mom. Obviously, now we are rushing from hospital to hospital. Hmm. I was in SS2. If you know me, I'm very, very busty. So when I say SS2, don't think that it's peanuts that was there. I had big fucking boobs in SS2. So we got to the hospital. We bought cards. I think we, we saw like three different doctors, like from here to here to here. Ah, that was the first time I was experiencing the whole seeing doctor, or whatever. So from here to here, to, it was UPTH. If you don't know UPTH, that's um, University of Port Harcourt Teaching Hospital. So we bought the card. The first doctor was a woman. And she, she wanted to examine me, obviously, with her hands. You know, there's how they do it with finger, be or hand or whatever. So she did it and she was like, she can't feel anything, but we should go to this place. The next place, it was a man. Hmm. I'm like, I was not even feeling that kind of way. <laughs> When I mean that kind of way, like I'm not like, but I was just feeling like, like if it if it's now, I'll be feeling so 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 uncomfortable that another man is touching my breast, like I might even vomit. It's going to be so irritating. But then I was just so scared. I hope I don't have breast cancer or something. That was a really little in my head. And then the pain, you know, when they are pressing your breast so much, there is an atom of pain. I don't know what. Man said he didn't say anything, but we should go for a scan. So that same day, I think it's the same day also. I don't know, went for a scan and it was also a male doctor. <laughs> now, you know, for those of you that have done scan before, there's this liquid substance like a cream, and you have to rub on that part of your body so the machine can like glide easily. And obviously, now it's the man that will rub it on my body. <laughs> So that's how this man told me that I should remove everything. I was coming from school, so I think I was wearing screen uniform. I was wearing screen uniform. So normally I wear bra, singlet, and my uniform. This man said I should take off everything. I was so freaking shy. I was so shy. We took, I took everything and I laid down, like looking upwards. And then, obviously my mom was there, and there was a female nurse there. To. the man was even uncomfortable i was noticing his movement he was like calling the nose that people should come here people should come here so he then proceeds to rub the cream <laughs> he rubbed the cream was touching around it thinking about it now if it was now never i will make sure it's a female doctor never ever ever see eh? never hey god but then i was just scared nervous I was shy a bit, but ha, 
it is now never will i allow a male doctor touch me like that so he rubs the whole cream on my breast and then he's there moving with the machine and at the end of the day there was nothing there i don't even know what is wrong with me i don't know which part of the breast i touch all this stress and all this whatever for nothing you know like i was praying that there should be something there or no please but i mean i just stressed myself and put myself through that later that same evening Hi babies, have I done an intro on this vlog? You guys, take me as I am. I'm so pumped too, I'm happy because today is my by force off day. I didn't want to have off day during the week. I felt to have an off day on Saturday so that from Friday when I come, I now have Saturday and Sunday to myself. I don't want them, if you know what I mean. They by force put this thing on my head. It's a long story, short, but we're here. Today is today is Wednesday, and tomorrow is my clearance day. God, I can't even rest in peace. Can't even rest in peace. This night nice now. Anyway, I slept well yesterday. I knowing that I'm not going anywhere today. Today, hmm, I'm finally going to pick up my. 100k skincare product that I got. It's going to have a. Why does it look like my skin is going? Make a see problem. <laughs> hey, after I finish paying for this skincare product, you better don't glow yet. I've been paying small, small. Okay, no, I've been paying for one week now. Like, I've used one week to complete the payment. Yesterday, made it one week. So today, I'm going to pick it up. Let me tell you guys the truth about why I don't vlog. Eh? <clears throat> Everywhere I go around this area, I'm on bike. I'm always using bike. I don't take no over, no boat, no nada. I'm always on bike. And I'm not about to vlog on bike in this league was in the no-go. In short, anyway, in the no-go snatch my phone. Oh, you know when you're taking boats or when you're taking an Uber, you're just chilling at the back, you can do your video, you can like video outside, you can talk if you want. And those things but this one on top of bike anyways i'm going to pick maybe when i get to the store i'll do okay oh until i'm out and i get to where i am the next thing i'm thinking about is how how i'm going home immediately i don't have any chill outside is not for me like i said the video is going to have a separate video i'm sure it's going to come up before this one but we'll see how that goes yeah, I went to the salon to take off my hair. That hair was giving me crazy headache. Like the headache was mad. I told them I I, I wanted to with him, and this is what they could come up with. Nice. Well, I complete. They say I'm complaining. So nice. Watch guys later. No wonder this was what was making me to glow. Mirror was just here. If you don't know, mirror is a kind of reflector. Let me show you guys. So this is it. Baby, don't worry. Oh, don't worry. I'll use delivery people. Anyone I come up with, I'm going to let you guys know. Ciao. Several hours later. Bye. Finally. I know I said I was going to pick it up, but I didn't go again. I paid a whooping amount of 1,500. Whereas this place, if I enter bike, going is 150 coming is 200 the weather was changing so my thoughts hello you've been expecting me healthy skin bit for you this is the cutting part i'm guessing this is a gift oh shit i paid for it i forgot 1000 this am i supposed to be showing you guys in this video okay i'm going to have a separate video this is my little kids gifts after buying steals of how much this is everything i got bye for now later that same evening
guys my outfits. Hey, it's so hard, Chloe. Okay, let's see. 